Corbin's fashion and beauty program is next to give you some fresh ideas on how to look good. Jim Hopkins follows, then we take another look at First Report, three local programs here on CTV. Tonight on Jim Hopkins Live, we reach new heights as we explore life at the airport. As well, we talk to the author of a controversial new play due to open this weekend in Christchurch and more. Jim Hopkins Live, CTV tonight, 7.30. When you want the best in regional news, join us at 5.30. And 8 o'clock. Now twice a night. See First Report on CTV at the time of your choice. Corbin's Fashion and Beauty. Tonight we're going to preview an exciting range of lingerie by form, we're going to visit a local radio personality and we're going to see a complete makeover from top to toe. Hi Jeanette, welcome to the program. Hi. Tell me, what are you doing with yourself at the moment? Recently I um, left work to have a baby so I've been at home with the baby. The most important profession in the world, motherhood. And what's inspired you to agree to come to CTV and have a makeover done tonight? Well, with summer coming, I've really just decided that I'd like a change. Tonight, we're going to dress you from Thornton Hall. Your makeup's going to be done by Shiseido. And we're going to go through now and have Wella do your hair. Oh, that'd be lovely. Great. Nick <laughs> Kent, you're the technical consultant for Wella here in Canterbury. Tell us what you're going to do to Jeanette's hair tonight. Okay, Jeanette's hair is actually very thick and quite strong, so it's hard for Jeanette to manage. So I'm actually going to totally revamp it and take it off quite short, uh, giving her a total new look. To give Jeanette's hair some actual height in the style, I'm going to use some of the Reva Just Volume, which is actually a product that gives volume without any curl. To finish off the hairstyle, I'm going to use a semi-permanent gentle persuasions uh, using the mahogany. Form, all cotton lycra, moulded to fit. Three colourways, white, misty blue and black. Briefs, crop tops, camis, body suits, now known just as body, all with soft skin lace. Under wide bras, accentuated body suits. All cotton lycra, moulded to fit. Form by Lane Walker Rudkin, made right here in Christchurch. Competitively priced, and available in stores throughout New Zealand. The, I, I can tell the hair's been cut. What else have you been doing? <laughs> well, with the Reva Just Volume that I was talking about earlier, as you can see, it's actually given Jeanette's hair lift. As, as I said before, her hair is actually quite strong and straight, so what it's actually done is made it uh, easier for Jeanette as a client to do it at home, which I think is very important. And we've finished it off with a very subtle Gentle Persuasions mahogany. What I've actually done is finger dried it, just using my hands, so a client at home will be able to do it very, very easily. I used a little bit of the high hair mousse to give the hair more hold, and finished it off with the 
high hair shine cream, which actually separates the hair slightly, giving it gloss, and just separates the, the movement in the hair as well. I then actually finished it off using the high hair hairspray. Right, we'll go through to makeup now and see the finished look. That'd be great. As from this morning, you're officially relieved of your duties. Sacked. Suspended. You forget I'm on leave. Leave? Yes, a special leave. You made that quite clear this morning. Nonsense, Callum. Really? You're not going anywhere. You want to bet the rent on that? You want a passport by Saturday, it's going to cost you a century. And that's cheap, believe me. See, I haven't got many friends. And he's in trouble. Callum, Sunday at 8.30 on CTV. For that special occasion, let Valentine's put you in the fashion picture. Fashions and accessories for total coordination. Flirty, nautical, navy and white. Hot favourites, fuchsia and magenta. Saucy yellow framed in black. The many classic looks of black and white. All from such well-known labels as Miss Deb, Pepper Tree, Dream Girls and Jeff Riddell. Fashion at its best. From Ballantyne's City Mall. Save now at Dowson's Crazy Price Sale. Jump Sports Boots down to $49.95. Kasogi Boots in full leather, $49.95. Adidas Tennis Champion, a bargain at $39.95 at Dowson's Crazy Price Sale. Munns Menswear introduce a special offer that'll have you looking great. Buy any suit from Munns and get $200 to spend on anything in the store. The latest suit styles from the leaders in men's fashion and the latest in shirts, ties and accessories to the value of $200 is yours free. Or select from Munns extensive range of latest season leisure wear. The choice is yours. $200 worth of top quality menswear with every suit purchased. Only at Munns Menswear in Armagh Street, where they're open all weekend. Doing it with style. This month, I'm offering unbelievable deals on the Lada Samara. But don't forget the other Lada models. Economical sedans and wagons, rugged utilities and off-road vehicles at prices that'll have you laughing all the way to the bank. Rock Hudson plays a character who loves the fast lane, but things go from bad to worse. You'll definitely need your handkerchiefs for this one. And I think Dr. Phillips died so that he could live. Yes, what a complete waste. Mrs. Phillips. Please don't start a scene. I'm only trying to tell you that... Look out! She'll never see again, thanks to you. Write a check for that, Mr. Merrick. Magnificent Obsession, tonight's movie. Hi, Corrine. Now, you're the regional training consultant for Shiseido, and with you today is Catherine, who's the resident Shiseido consultant at Ballantines. Um, how do you assess what skin type? Well, we generally take a good look at the skin, and uh, the skin itself will tell us. Um, we've got a very, very fine skin texture on this uh, skin here, which means that she has an actual normal to a dry area. Her She's normal down centre and dry out the sides. So how do you then go and assess which products Jeanette will need? 
Well, with establishing what skin she has, we go ahead then and use um, the correct skincare product. Um, for Jeanette, we've used the um, cleansing cream first. We've come on with the concentrate softener and um, the facial care uh, rich moisturizer. Um, we've used a soothing lotion toner for her and then pre-makeup and now we're applying her makeup. What routine are we going to follow through this makeup? First we're going to apply Jeanette's foundation, um, then we will do the eyes followed by the blusher and then her lips. Why do we mascara the top lashes first? We generally do them so that, um, followed by uh, the blusher so that those top lashes have a chance to dry. Um, and when they have, we go ahead and do the bottom lashes and if the top lashes need a second coating, they're nice and dry to apply it without them sticking together. Tell me about the colours you've used on Jeanette's eyes. Well, we've used um, a, a coppery tone on Jeanette's eyes and um, bronzy tones simply because they're quite soft and, and quite natural and Jeanette um, really didn't want a heavy makeover. She wanted something that was soft and natural so we've given her that look with her eyes. And with your selection of lip colours, which usually team up with the nails as well, um, for the summer, what's prevalent? For summer, um, we have quite deep colours out um, this year. We've got um, a very burnished uh, deep red and um, a, a purpley sort of a red out for summer and browns, very deep browns and um, some very soft um, melon shades. Quite a mixture to go um, and highlight with the brights, I think. Hmm. And um, the lip line she's drawing now, does this, this help the lips stand out, or, or what does it do? It gives a, your lips a definite line. It helps to enable to um, shape lips better, and it's wonderful for stopping uh, lipstick from, from bleeding. Wow, very glamorous indeed. Tell me, is there anything else you'd like to tell me that's special about the Shiseido range? The particular makeup that we've used today is called Le Maquillage. It has um, skin care built into it. Um, so every time you apply it, your skin's being looked after. And it also has wonderful protection against the UV rays, which are so important for us these days. <laughs> Christine, I notice in your new TV advertising campaign for Form, you're pushing the fact that Form's very comfortable to wear. Why is this? What you'll notice in our, our TV advertising is that we're talking a lot about cotton lycra. Um, cotton lycra is a, a very special fabric. Um, women know about cotton, they know that, know that it's natural, comfortable, healthy, hygienic. Um, and when you combine that with lycra, which is a very special um, elastic fine yarn, um, you get a lovely smooth fit. The, the fabric actually clings and moulds to the body. Where do you get the ideas for the styles you have and also how do you ar arrive at the colours you use? Well, um, we get them from all over the place really. Um, some of it comes from up here and, and some of it, um, we do travel a lot. Um, we pick up ideas from the States and from Europe, um, in particular the UK. Um, sometimes trends we follow and other times we set them. I mean, we have to take into account what New Zealand women want also. Um, I notice you have bikini briefs, which most rangers have, but you've also gone into a full brief. Yes, the reason we went into a full brief is because um, I noticed that there was a, a real gap in the marketplace. Um, women have not been catered to well um, in the full brief area, um, particularly in cotton lycra. Um, and let's face it, a lot of women prefer a full brief style, but they also want something that's flattering and a little bit lacy as well. Very feminine. Yes, that's right. That's what form's all about. Um, I've read a lot about women, and I, I myself are wearing um, body suits and camisoles, actually showing a little bit under, like I have on today, my jacket. Is this socially acceptable? Oh, absolutely, Mirren. Um, Form is, is, is a comfortable, um, flattering um, brand. It, it's not at all raunchy and um, it's quite acceptable to wear um, underwear as outerwear. In fact, in the industry we have a, a buzzword for it called innerwear, something that's worn underneath but is also seen. And what about prices? It looks very expensive, is it? 
No, prices are, are incredibly reasonable. Um, we're very competitive. Um, you can pick up a pair of cotton-like Fabrice for ten dollars, and with the with the lace um, range, um, they go from sixteen to eighteen. Um, you always pay a little bit more to to get the the lace trims and what have you. The all important question: Where can Christchurch women go and buy form underwear? Well, form is available just about all over the place. Um, you can go to Ballantines, Arthur Barnett's, Farmers. Um, most of the specialty stores also stock form, so it, it's it's nationally available. Christine, I believe you've got a special offer this week for CTV viewers. Tell me about it. Yes, that's right, Marin. Um, I've decided that it would be a good idea to, to let women try form cotton-like for briefs, so we'd like to offer 25 pairs to the first 25 women who write to me, um, give me their details, I'll need to know what size you are, small, medium or large. If you put your details, name and address in an envelope um, and send it to me, Christine, Lane Walker Rudkin, PO Box 2087 Christchurch, I'll send 25 pairs of free briefs out to the first women who, who write to me. That's fantastic. Christine, this lycra is really good. I can see, see how you get your form into it and it stretches. This lace is nice. Tell me about it. Well, Mirren, um, this lace comes in from um, overseas. Um, the lycra fabric is, is, is made here in New Zealand, but we, we occasionally um, use um, overseas laces. It's got, as you can see, a lovely um, plume-type pattern to it, as you can see. Um, it's what we call a stretch lace. It's got its own you know, natural elastication, um, so we don't need to put extra, extra elastic binding around the leg. And you can just throw these in the washing machine, or is there special Absolutely care Absolutely, no, no special care, straight into the washing machine. <laughs> Our beauty tip tonight comes from Shiseido. When you apply an eye pencil, because they are all wax based and very, very soft, they do have a tendency to smudge. If, when you've applied your pencil, you just go over very lightly your pencil line with the same color shadow, you get quite a definite outlook on your color around your eye and a nice, soft smudging. It helps to keep your eye pencil in place for the whole day as well. Pens come home in a new series of Just Good Friends, but some things never change. You were supposed to meet me here last year. You are exactly 12 months late. Yeah, well, sorry about that. Sorry? That's it, is it? Just sorry. Vince is as reliable as ever. The moment you mention Notre Dame, everyone, like everyone, tells a quasi do joke. I know what you mean, Ben. I have to give anyone help. It's a whole new set of circumstances in Just Good Friends, Saturday at 7 on CTV. For that special occasion, let Valentine's put you in the fashion picture. Fashions and accessories for total coordination. Flirty, nautical, navy and white. Hot favourites, fuchsia and magenta. Saucy yellow framed in black. The many classic looks of black and white. All from such well-known labels as Miss Deb, Pepper Tree, Dream Girls and Jeff Riddell. Fashion at its best from Ballantine's City Mall. Crompton's Bathroom Bonanza is here. Everything to make your bathroom beautiful is now at bargain prices. Save up to $100 on Socolo Ceramic Disc Bathroom Taps. The Coroma Dual Flush Uniset Toilet System Seat and Pan from just $229. San Michelle Midas Vanity Units, only $389. Save over $400 on Engelfield Cabana Shower Cubicles and the Engelfield Gondolas Bar Bath is down to $979. HMC 344 Ceramic Disc Chrome Sink for it's $123 and the White Felton Mix Regal Overbath Shower Unit is just $159. There are heaps more specials in Crompton's Bathroom Bonanza, now on at Chewham Street and in Victoria Street, Rangiora.
Munns Menswear introduce a special offer that'll have you looking great. Buy any suit from Munns and get $200 to spend on anything in the store. The latest suit styles from the leaders in men's fashion and the latest in shirts, ties and accessories to the value of $200 is yours free. Or select from Munns' extensive range of latest season leisure wear. The choice is yours. $200 worth of top quality menswear with every suit purchased. Only at Munns Menswear in Armagh Street, where they're open all weekend. Doing it with style. fans for all the latest news views and information be sure to catch horsepower racing preview fridays at seven on ctv racing personalities give you an inside view of the galloping and harness racing world and we preview upcoming meetings the horsepower racing preview show fridays at seven on ctv lots of fine fashion shops and now some fine eating places. The latest is a cafe restaurant called Bedalus back here where all the cafe society people are hanging out so let's go on and have a look. Martin McPherson, well known lounge lizard. What do you think of this new venue for Christchurch Oh people? it's great isn't it? You know, Christchurch has now got more than one place to go and have a drink and a meal and, and, and Rich has done really well here. It's, and, and of course Andrew Barclay, our architect, deserves the comp. The compliment, it's beautiful, very relaxed. And you think New Zealanders are going to get away from the booze barn mentality? Oh, it's obvious. I've just been away travelling the country the last 13 weeks and there's little places like this cropping up all around the country. And, and I you go to Auckland and Christchurch is always referred to as being such a boring place, but I tell you what, there's nothing like this in Auckland. Very tasty. Nick Stick, an unusual name. Mind you, an unusual venue. What prompted you to want to get involved in opening a um, restaurant like this? We just felt that there was a need in the market for uh, um, a place like this and we talked about it for about six months and uh, dreamed about it for six months and then finally the whole thing came together and yeah. Is it, this is sort of what's happening in Europe isn't it? That's what we the, along the lines of yes, we went, wanted to Mediterranean, real European feel which we've got with the food and, and the design. It took a while to, to, get, to get the feeling that we wanted inside. And um, who did the interior? It's quite radical, really. Andrew Barclay did all the interior design. Um, in conjunction with what we wanted, he um, went off on his own tangent a couple of times, and uh, we sort of had, we had, to, had to pull him back to, oh, no, it was going to be wilder than this. We had to, uh, we had to pull him back to earth and, and try and get the feeling that we wanted. Um, in the midst of it all, Richard, one of the other partners, was, he, went to, um, he went to Europe and had a look around over there, and we sort of talked to him over the phone, and got ideas and everything and, and this is what we came up with. But. Here we are at Rocket and Races in my there's some lovely dressed ladies today. Excuse me madam, where did you get your oh. outfit from? <laughs> from Panache, my beau Barbara Lee. Oh, and um, are you going to be entering the Corbin's Best Dressed Lady at the races during Cup Week? Maybe, <laughs> maybe. And are you going to be entering the Best Dressed Lady? Probably not, no. <laughs> not even with a $10,000 prize. I could be tempted, yeah. So if you won any money today? Um, I'm afraid not, I'm not much like professors. <laughs> and where did you get your fabulous outfit uh, from? This is made by Barbara Lee as well from Panache. Zen from Shiseido. And of course Shiseido is from the east and Zen represents all the warmth and the spicy fragrances of the east. Zen contains the spices such as the corianders and the cloves, the garlics, etc., which are all used in perfume. So this gives a very, very spicy and lively. But at the same time, Zen is also a very warm, soft fragrance representing the Japanese people who are a very gentle 
and rather delicate people. So we see before us the warm, soft Japanese fragrance Zen. <laughs> Alison, it's a fairly busy lifestyle being one of the team with C93. How do you choose your fashion and what gives you direction? I have the fashion sense of a dead chicken, basically. I go into shops, I look at things and say, oh, I really like that, it may be something a little different. Take it home, try it on, maybe even wear it once, and then hang it up in the cupboard and just don't wear it again. So. I'm not, I haven't got a definite focus on what I like and black is basically my, um, uh, that's what I go for is darker colours. I know not to pick things that don't have sleeves, I like to have sleeves on clothes. Um, nothing uh, above the knee or on the knee because I've got faces that, uh, faces, knees that look like um, sort of squidgy old white fat faces so I mean like I don't wear anything above the knee at all. Um, in summer I have to keep myself pretty much covered up because of my skin colour. Um, don't wear orange, don't wear yellow. There are things that I know I definitely can't do, but as far as style goes or uh, cuts, I just wouldn't have a clue. <laughs> You're a fairly casual person, yeah. so I guess jeans are a great medium for your life. Oh, they're great. I, I hate wearing skirts in a, in a work situation because I just can't relax in skirts, um, especially when you're sitting on a chair in, in the studio in the morning when you're doing the show. I just I don't like big flappy bits of material around my legs and stuff. So jeans, track pants, sometimes big baggy shorts now that summer's coming, they're good. You talk about colour restrictions obviously with your hair colour. Mm. What are you going to do about all these brights this summer? Are you going to get into them? I don't follow, I don't like following too closely the sort of things that we're seeing in the shops because we can't all be anorexic toothpicks. I mean women have hips and they have shape and you can't wear these things that are being designed for almost prepubescent girls. They just don't look right on women. The stuff from the 60s, the hip stuff and the um, geometric circles and the bright colours, the paisleys, they're fine on other people. That they, they just don't work for me so I won't be buying them. One thing I do like um, uh, very, very much are hats. I was in Australia recently and I saw this hat. This is my, this is my prize buy really. It's, um, it's an Italian hat, which doesn't really matter. I mean, who cares where it's from, but the colour of the straw and the blue on it. And it has a bow on the back there, which is almost sort of, almost school girly, I suppose. But I just love it and I love hats in summer, apart from being really practical and good, good for your skin. And sort of, so you should really wear it like that. But it should come down over your face and just keep the sun off. So, will you be one of the ladies competing for the $10,000 prize at the Corbin's Best Dress competition? Nah, no way, no, I mean, well look, I, I'm a tracksuit person, I'd maybe stick on a few little, when I was doing a bit of telly and things like that, you had to wear a certain standard of clothing, but no, I won't be wearing <laughs> look quite different, almost drastic change. How do you feel about it? It is a change, but I love it. And are you happy with the undergarments form I've given you to wear? Yes, I am. The lycra's lovely to wear. How do you think your husband's going to feel about this new look? I'm sure he will love it. OK, thanks very much for coming in. Thank you.